I have watched you, Victor Von Doom. For years, fans have been crying out for an MCU Doctor Doom, as these ones didn't quite cut it. With the Fantastic Four finally arriving in the MCU, there's no way that Doctor Doom can stay away from the silver screen for too long. Not only is he tied to the Fantastic Four comics, but his very existence is based on outdoing Reed Richards. I am your superior in every conceivable way, Richards. Although Doctor Doom has been seen clashing with powerhouses like the Thing and Silver Surfer and winning, the Doc doesn't actually inherently have any superpowers. Victor Von Doom is the end result of money, political power, intelligence, and ambition, as well as an obsession with technology, the occult, and probably a heavy dash of multiple mental maladies. Doom does not surrender. Victor Von Doom is one of the few people in the Marvel Universe to master science and magic together. He's discovered secrets that others would kill to obtain, including immortality. It's important to note that Doom doesn't see himself as the villain of the story. He names himself a hero, and it's those who oppose him who are the real bad guys. Leave. Now. This is over. I agree. In a twisted way, Victor's goals are laced with nobility, as he does truly seek to end the suffering of the human race, but it's by bringing it all under his rule. He believes that the future of humanity weighs on his shoulders and his shoulders alone. Children. The greatest villains aren't just written to be a threat, but are also connected to causes we care about or have understandable motivations, like wanting to save the world or feeling heartbreak from losing a loved one. We as the audience obviously don't agree with how villains do what they do, but when written well, a villain's story arc will make you pause and ask yourself, how would I feel? Victor Von Doom, for all the power he has in the universe or multiverse really, he's an incredibly broken person, mentally, emotionally, and physically. Combined with his intelligence, obsession for all forms of power, and a deep guilt that's tied to his family and Latveri itself. Doom makes for an amazingly complex villain who needs to be part of the MCU preferably sooner than later.